Speaking of Wimbledon, of course, you played at Wimbledon, that memorable match against uh, against Sampras. You you beat the previous uh, opponent, Mark Hilton, in straight sets. That was in 2001. Tell me about going into the uh, the Lawn Tennis Association uh, with your kit bag, mm. with your rackets, and and just walking walking into that iconic venue. What for the Sampras match or just well, in general? I mean, uh, just as a, as I mean, I mean, obviously, I'm sure you've been you know you, you've been in and out of there for many years, mm. but going in as as a competitor, getting ready for your next match. Well, it was always a dream of mine. Actually, it was always a dream of mine to play the best player on the biggest stage and play my best match. And I was able to do that. And, and it was pretty nerve-wracking playing him because the respect I, I, the respect I had, but there's also a little bit of a side story to it. That, that, and I think it's a sort of a great lesson that I learned probably a little bit too late in my career. I practiced with him a couple of times mm. before he had to play Wimbledon finals, even Izovic, he wanted to hit the left-hander. So his coach asked me, I said, of course, why, why, why wouldn't you? But then the next time I saw him, he ignored me. And when you're a little young, you think, well, of course, it's Pete Sampras, you know, he's not going to speak to me. But then as I got a little older, for me, there was, well, I'm still a pro and I think you should respect people. Yeah. So when I, when I, same thing happened um, before in 2000, asked me to play, um, I was in Canada, asked me to hit with him, ignored me the week after the US Open. And I thought, next time I see him, I'm going to force him to say hello, which I did. Yeah. So actually playing Sampras the following year, I think that little moment helped me. I mean, I still had incredible respect because I still think he would beat anyone on a grass court, Federer even in his pomp. Amazing. But, but I think that little bit of help, because you, cause when you're at my level, which was between 100 and 200, you're seeing these players on TV and you're going, I could know why I can achieve that. So you are a little intimidated. But thankfully, I was able to, to, to play my greatest match against him. Unfortunately, wasn't able to win, but I couldn't have done anything better. 